Hi guys, it's me Katie Cakes 5 and today we're going to be making some homemade peanut butter. You know, do you know, it's full of preservatives and chemicals from all the stuff you buy at the shop, so let's get started. Okay, so I'm um, homemade peanut butter. Now before you get started, you absolutely need to be using a food processor for this. I do not recommend using a blender unless you're very certain you've got a very powerful blender because most blenders are not strong enough to handle what we're about to do here. So into our food processor, I'm adding peanuts, salted peanuts. Don't use the unsalted ones because they tend to be way too plain. And put them in there. Now I'm putting about two cups of roughly about 300 grams worth of peanuts. So I'm going to put the lid on. There she goes. And we're going to use the pulse button to just gently crush up these peanuts until they start to form a bit of a paste. As you can see, still kind of powdery, but because the natural oils from the peanuts are coming out, it's kind of sticking and and glowing up together so it's not quite paste yet so so but we're getting there so hold on okay so now what we're going to do now is i'm just going to add in a tablespoon of just plain vegetable oil i'm using olive oil that works well for me now adding in one tablespoon now, and if I wanted to be um, slightly smoother later, I can always add a bit more. So back with the lid on, there she goes, and again just pulse it until it's smooth. Add a touch more oil. And pulse again. We're just going to open this up lovely and smooth now so just gonna quick little taste mm. good we need a bit more oil I think so I'll add a little bit more and we'll pulse it one more time Yum. Right, now all we need to do is lift our beta out. We're ready to put this into our container. And our peanut butter is complete. And now I can put the lid on and, and store this in the fridge. Now, obviously it's not going to be like 100% thick or or smooth. If you like crunchy peanut butter, just leave it in there for a short time, like about two minutes, just until you get that crunchy sort of consistency. Let me just put that down for a second while I open this up. Okay, this is really hard. Uh, beautiful right here so I'm um, I'm just gonna take a bit of the lid and see what it's like mm. beautiful it's got that roasted sort of like peanut butter flavor I recommend that you use salted peanuts for this um obviously because it's got the right flavor don't use the unsalted ones because they tend to be way too plain and you're gonna think it's not just taste right so Hope you enjoyed that recipe. Check out my videos on my other channel, and I'll see you later for another cooking recipe. Bye.